ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Another video brought to you by Rib today. Another tutorial, and we're going to be following on from our last, our last, which was the how to hide buildings and objects in the Armor 3 map in an Armor 3 mission. So today we're going to go through. We're going to do some spawn points. How to add a spawn point. How to edit the spawn points. Um, spyglass. How to remove the spyglass because that is a pain in the ass. And we're, we're with the 3.148 because that's the only decent version, stable enough. To, to work from that's on Armaholic so we'll start with that and that's the one I know inside and out uh, I know you say 4.4 is the if is released but however that's the missions I've worked on are like fucking 9.56 except compared to the few edits that have been done on the on the the 4.4 but anyway this is the one we're starting with and what we want to do first is download it so you've got your server set up I'm just gonna uh, take you through some stuff in there so let's go to the Altus Life and your mission folder will look like this. Now, to get rid of this, this spyglass, first of all, because it, you, a lot of the time it's just non-stop kicking you off, and it's 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 even said by Tom Tonic that it is a waste of the time. So let's delete that, and let's go to init player local, wherever the files are calling it, and we need to get rid of that. Was it the input? Yeah. Get rid of this line here, and now we need to save that, and now we need to go to the functions.h, which is also here. And we need to get rid of the spyglass section, which is here. Okay, so that would be spyglass removed. You'd have no problems now. People get kicked off, etc. Spyglass is gone. Next point, spawn points. So, well, first of all, we'll show you how to open the mission. And this applies for any kind of map, any mission. So, copy that mission.sqm. But first of all, let's go into armor. 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 We'll just do it on Altus for now, because the only difference being would be uh, running a mod for the map. But first of all, you'd have to you'd drag all the, select all the icons in the Altus map, Control and C, and copy them over to your new map with Control and V. So let's go. Let's just play. We only want to get an Altus map up. I'm going to create a mission. We'll drop this mission SQM in that folder. Well, I'm confused we'll do it as we go along. So don't take too long, Armour. For the people saying, am I going to do tutorials with the... when I make my own map? Well, it's going to be a whole loop learning uh, curve for me. I've never worked with Terrain Builder, Bulldozer, etc. So, but once I get familiar with it, yep, you will be seeing them. So yeah, stay tuned for that. But I need to familiarise myself with them first. Okay, Fallujah. So yeah, this is when I was looking at Fallujah, which was an absolute awesome map. I've never seen so much, uh, so dense, pop. You know what I mean? Population is crazy. Right, come on, come on. Do this in the two D or the three D ad, so it makes no difference. Altis. So let's go into that. We'll do it in the 3D today because I do a lot in the 2D. But the only reason I'd work in the 2D is obviously when I started my armor career, I just know that editor inside and out. Like, you know how many hours of armor I've got? Quite a few. So, all we need to do for now is put down a unit or anything and we need to save this mission. We're going to save it as a test when it catches up. Okay. Save. File name. Test. Save. Okay, what we want to do now is go to your documents, armor 3, missions, and there it is, test alpha, altus. Okay, so back to the downloaded or well, your mission folder, which mine was this. And I need to get that mission, copy that. Go back to your documents, armor 3, go back to your mission folder. If you're on a different profile, it'll be documents on the three other profiles but my main profile is what we're on at the minute missions test get rid of that paste that and it's gonna we're gonna load it back up and it's gonna ask us to convert it which we will test import okay new format blah blah no problem here it is so if we go to the map if you look there's the actual mission default mission of Altis Life that's given to you by Tonic. This is the off armaholic. 
So, all you do now if you wanted it on a different map, obviously you're running the mod for the different map, you just select all them units, control and C, open up your new map, and control and V and paste them down. Uh, but the units here, you do have to make playable again. So we've got rid of spyglass, spawn points, so each of these towns will have a marker. This one for instance, Civ Spawn 2. So on the list when people come to spawn in the game, uh, if they go to the second one, let's go to the folder. Missions, oh no, 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 downloads, else life. So here's your main folder again. Dialogue, function, FN spawn point CFG, edit. Okay, so civilian here, case civilian. The second one was Pygos, which is Pygos. If I wanted to rename that to whatever, it wouldn't matter. Um, so he would spawn when you spawn in, they would spawn there. If you want to move it, simply move it. Let me just delete it just to show you to put another marker down. This one up here, markers. You want an empty marker. Bear with me, it's been a while since I've been in the uh, in this editor. Where's the bloody empty marker? Um, 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 yeah, I don't go in either, do I? I'm always in the bloody. There we go, empty. That's what we want. We found it in the end. Civ underscore spawn underscore 2. It must be named the same as it's named in your FN spawn point CFG. Civ underscore spawn underscore 2. Okay, if I wanted to add more spawn, all you do, see this little comma, you must have that. The last one does not have have one. And that is very, very important. So put the comma in if we want to add an extra spawn. Copy that. Paste that. Do, 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 do. Ooh, what are we doing? So you must remove that last comma. Of, and this is the same applies on every shop you work on. Uh, Civ spawn 5. And this will be Rib Town. Ribville. Okay, uh, so obviously you'd save that, there's no comma there, happy days. So if we put down another comment, another marker now, marker empty, system empty, put it there. Civ spawn 5, Civ spawn 5. If you've clicked that on the list, Ribsville, that's where you'll spawn. So that's your spawn points, guys. Right, there's one other thing you'd have to do for your spawn points, so you'll, you'll spawn in the middle of the sea. So if we go to back to your mission folder you need to go to court in it sieve edit you see this here delete this okay you're no longer spawn in the middle of the sea so that's what you do for that so that spawn points covered uh, what else are we going to look at new units so if you wanted to add more more units simply just select your unit control C copy and the good thing about the Eden editor is that they're already playable. In the 2D you have to make them playable. But one thing you have to make sure is important, they have got a name and a description. Or when you go to the ATM to try and transfer to this player, etc., it will not work. That's very important, make sure they've got a name and description. And they must be playable. So same applies for the cops, if you wanted more cops. Control C and just paste them there. Same applies for the medics. Control C and paste them there, but make sure they've got name and descriptions. That's how to add more cops, medics, and civilians. We've done spawn points, we've done spyglass, and now let's just have a quick look at the whitelist. Where was we? Downloads. Altus Life. Cool. This cop one here. Player ad rate, wait till display. Okay, let me just double check because it's been a bloody while since I've been in here. It's desktop, where's one of my folders? August. Let's just do this. We have to remove this section here, but I just want to double check because it's been a bloody while. Um, core. <laughs> Cop. Okay. Right. Ooh. Get that one as well. Can we get it through that? Nope. Yeah. Okay, so as you can see, private, private, play ad rating, that's still there, wait until, that's still there. And so it's this section, just this section here. To remove the whitelist and you want to make it public, just remove that. Or if you if you just leave it, then there is a whitelist on for cops. 
Okay, so that is your whitelist, just this little section here. That's all for now, guys. If it helps, remember to like and subscribe. Uh, this is, will be a continued series till I've more or less covered everything I know. I uh, hope you enjoyed. If you don't already, yeah, subscribe, hit that like button. Adios, amigos.